Today we're at 3034 Lincoln Log Way, McDonough, Georgia. Doing a move out inspection. Uh, first thing I want you to notice is obviously it's going to need a final cut. Grass is pretty tall as well as this side. You can see that. Um, outside of the house is in pretty good condition. One thing you want you to notice is the shutter up there needs a little some new paint on it. I'm going to go ahead and go inside now. Upon entry, you come in to uh, the foyer area. As you can tell, it's hardwood floor. There's a hallway right in front of you. To the right is what I label the bonus room. And to the left is the dining room. One thing I want you to notice when you first walk in, there's some scratches on the ground right here. Uh, looks like normal wear and tear. There's a couple scratches on the hardwood floor. And that's where we just came in from right there. Uh, if you enter to the, if you go to the right, like I just stated, you enter in what I labeled the bonus room. Uh, I guess it could be used as an office. Uh, just one thing I want you to notice in here is obviously just the scratches on the wall. Right there as well. Uh, some more down here where the baseboard's at. Some more scratches and marks on the wall. Uh, and that's going to be a, a, a thing you see in a lot of the rooms here. A lot of scratches on the wall. It's probably going to need new paint and probably the entire home. Um, walking across. You enter into the dining room as I stated earlier. Uh, as I stated earlier, you're going to see a lot of marks on the wall. There's some right there, right there. If you look down here, some more marks on the wall. Coming out of the dining room, if you go straight, you're going to Go into the kitchen area. Um, again, just marks all over the walls here. Some more right there. Some more right there. That's where we just entered from. Um, again, more marks on the wall right there, a bunch of stains on the wall. Um, as far as the cabinets underneath the sinks, very dirty, as you can see. Coming out of the kitchen, if you look across, there's the Eden part of the kitchen, which is right next to the living room. Uh, we'll go ahead and hit the, the Eden part of the kitchen. This is... Uh, the part of the house where I saw most of the damage. Um, again, uh, marks and scratches on the wall. Uh, floor's a little bit stained here and there. Uh, some more marks and stuff on the wall. Uh, the door that leads out to the garage, uh, which is part of the Eden area, you can see a bunch of scratches and marks. More scratches. And also the door exiting the, the house to go outside to the backyard. Um, there is some, some pieces of the floor missing there, which those are gonna need to be possibly uh, removed and fixed. Uh, if you walk out of the Eden area, which is right here, come down this little area right here, you enter into the laundry room. Again, just scratches, marks, marks, marks. Uh, as I said before, that seems to be a major thing in this home. 
Um, if you come to the door that I just said earlier, enters into the garage, you'll see some more damage out here. Um, you saw the you saw the scratches on the door to begin with. Uh, notice the stains on the ground. Uh, that seems to be common in a garage. No big deal. However, notice this uh, cutout in the wall. Um, as I recall, the tenant said there was some work done on this pipe, so they had to cut it out to get to it. Uh, and I think that was done by us. I don't know. You may need to check the records there. And also, the ceiling right here, there's a little hole cut in, inside of it. Um, other than that, just the normal scratches on the wall. Scratches. Scratches. Um, we're going to exit the garage. We're going to go ahead and hit the back backyard since the exit door is right here. Uh, first thing I want you to notice, opening the door, is notice the weather stripping on it. Just right there, all the weather shipping. Um, again, notice, like I said before, final cut definitely going to need to be needed. Stuff out here in the yard so you can get a good, good glimpse of the house. Looks like there's a basketball goal over there that's going to need to be picked up. Little kid's uh, toy house. We're going to go ahead and head back inside. We're going to hit the living room. This is right next to the dining room, as I said earlier. Uh, notice, again, scratches all over the walls uh, here as well, right there as well. Some more on this side. Uh, scratches, and there looks like there's maybe some minor staining in the carpet. And go ahead and exit the living room. That's the door we entered from. But instead of going down the hallway, we took a, a left into the dining room and all that stuff. Um, off the living room, there's the master bedroom, which is right here. Notice the few scratches right here on the door frame. And just the stained carpet right there, as well as right there. Um, and again, as you can guess, uh, some more scratches on the wall. Really seems to be the only major thing in here. There's where we just entered from. I'm gonna go in here to the master bed or master bathroom. I'm sorry. Uh, one of the light bulbs seems to be out. There's the uh, bathtub, looks like they left some stuff behind. Uh, the shower here. And the little toilet area. Again, there's some marks right there on the wall. There's a sink again, and that's where we just entered from. Uh, this is the closet. Decent size walk-in closet. We're going to exit the closet, exit the bathroom, back into the master bedroom, back out of the master bedroom. 
There's the living room and all that stuff. Uh, the kitchen. Oh, and also right here off to the kitchen is the one of the closets. Um, notice just the markings on the wall here there. It's hard to see on video. As well as the stained floor right there. Out of the kitchen, we're going to go down the hallway. Uh, this door right here leads to the half bath. sink, the toilet, and you go out of the half bath, uh, back to the foyer area where we entered from. I don't know if you noticed when we entered, the stairs were right here. One thing I want you to notice on the stairs is notice these stains at the very beginning as well as when you're walking up on the wall right where the handrail starts, scratch to the left and a scratch to the right. We're going to continue up the stairs. Uh, first thing I want you to notice as soon as we get upstairs is if you look up the uh, smoke detector is not attached to the ceiling. Um, Here's the hallway area. It's hallway right there too. We're gonna take a right to begin with into what I labeled bedroom two. Here's the closet. Notice again. The scratches on the wall here and there, uh, some little holes in the wall, some scratches down there as well. We're going to head out of bedroom two and take a left. Uh, we're going to go into what I labeled bedroom three. Again, notice on this right wall here all the scratches and stuff that's where we just entered from and there is the closet again some more scratches out of bedroom three gonna walk to the other side of the hallway uh, which brings us to two other more bedrooms as well as this bathroom we'll hit this bathroom real fast Bathroom's in decent shape, nothing really wrong with it. And that's where we just entered from. I'm gonna go out of the bathroom. Go into what I labeled bedroom four. Again, it's hard to see, but just some scratches and stuff on the wall. There's a closet right there. Everything else looks good. And we're going to hit the last and final bedroom. Brings us down this little stretch of hallway right here. Uh, it looks like maybe a finished attic or it could be another bonus room. I labeled it a bedroom because it does have a closet. One thing I recommend would obviously be would be uh, new paint on the walls, as you could tell, uh, scratches, and I mean that that seems to be in every room almost. Um, another thing I recommend would be uh, there's we just entered from in the closet, by the way. Another thing I recommend would be a deep clean of the carpet. Uh, some bedrooms or areas or seem stained a little bit. Um, some areas are, are good, like this bedroom doesn't really seem to be stained, but still a, a deep clean would, would be nice. Um, and 